real lazy day. But here are those. Farted in my face. <laughs> Her name is Moana. <laughs> <laughs> you know to like stir it up, whip it up, pick it up. That's insane. For a soft bite. Mm -mm. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Mariah. And if you're new here, hey girl, what's up? And if you're returning, thank you. <laughs> All right, today is what's today today's thursday it is the afternoon time i started my vlog off really really late but that's okay i just got out of the shower and i feel real, real good because i was like i was a little ripe but i smell real good now and i feel good and i look good i got one of the dresses on that i showed you guys in my last video isn't she cute you see isn't she cute and super comfy really really long i love it it's really cute and that's pretty much it and then i clean my face rising mist on my face but it's super hot up here as always and the summer's coming so it's just gonna get hotter yeah i haven't really i haven't really been doing anything today it's been a really laid back day i didn't even make breakfast today chris bought me like a breakfast burrito in the morning when he got off of work so it's been a real lazy day but this weekend should be fun we're gonna have some of Chris's family come over and we're gonna hang out a little bit. Also wanted to show you guys, because I, I mentioned it in my last video, but I don't think I ever showed you, um, the avocado. I can't really unpackage it yet because I need another week at least, but I wanna show you it's in the little baggie. I just hope and pray it's doing good. I'm wondering if I should like mist it, open the bag and mist it a little bit, just so it has some moisture in there. I think I might do that today. And then I also, let's just go down the stairs because I'm pretty much done here. Chris has Nehemiah, and they are currently picking up some salmon burgers for me and Chris to eat before he goes to work. Whew, girl, it is hot. I am sweaty so much. I love when I come down from upstairs and I hear the waterfall. It sounds so nice. But there's a lot of new updates, y'all. Like, there's a lot of new updates that I got to tell you about. Like, But here's the avocado. See, it's in this bag. It looks like it still has moisture in it. You see that? I'm, a, I'm just going to spritz it a little bit though. So I added like a couple more drops of water into it. And just letting it do its thing. We shall see in like another week. But also, oh, and my, um, my tulips, I kept calling them lilies in the last video, but my tulips, they started blooming and opening up. Doesn't that look so nice? This one's my favorite. It looks so pretty. Look at the colors on it. They're slowly still opening up, but look at this one. This one's really opened. But some of them are like leaning all kind of crazy ways. <laughs> I don't know, but they're blooming. They're opening up and they look really, really cool. So I have those two there and I decided to put the other one. It's dark in this room, but here are those right here. See how they're leaning? I don't know why they're dancing like that. <laughs> They're doing some kind of dance, but look at this one. Isn't it so cool? It's so pretty inside. I don't know if it's not getting enough sunlight or what, but yes. Those are the lilies and they look so, so cute. I don't know if you hear that, but I got a new puppy. Yes, I did. Well, Chris got a new puppy. We got the same breed. We got another Frenchie. Um, it's called the Merle print kind. It's like the spotted like Dalmatian looking ones, the gray, light gray and black spots. Um, I should show him, show you him, because he's crying. He cries so much. Oh my goodness. Now I got two babies. <laughs> Look at y'all. You see the little babies? Say hi, little babies. Her name is Moana. <laughs> Say hi, Moana. So we have Lily Koi, or Lily for short, the one you always see in my videos outside, running around like crazy. This is her little sister, Moana. They look exactly the same. They look like twins, except for one's tiny. Isn't she so cute? Once they get old enough, we're gonna impregnate them and make little babies. And we're gonna sell them. Ain't that right? You gonna make me some babies? <laughs> but yeah. My little cute fluffy baby babies. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm about to bust you out right now. That was, I was just about to say good morning, you guys. It's the next morning and this mofo down here going fart in my face. You're disgusting, bro. Yep, I'm about to put you on blast because you know what? You deserve every inch of this. Look at this. 
blew up the whole spot. But that just caught me off guard. I'm so mad right now that he just farted in my face when I was trying when I just brought out the camera to talk to you guys. He is mad disrespectful for that. That was trifling. No, oh, look at y'all. Now he's blaming the dog. No, I don't even think that dog has that much strength to push out something so freaking foul. That was nasty. Anyways, y'all, after, man, oh God, I got a headache and everything after that, man. I'm just, I'm so distraught. That that was so horrible. My head is banging right now. I think the, I think the, I'm getting fogged up right now. I can't even think straight. <laughs> My chest is getting real tight. I feel like it just got inside my, my throat and my chest. Oh man. <sighs> Anyways, you remember the guys I um introduced you to our new dog Moana? You guys will never believe it. I was so upset this morning, like so profusely upset because this dog then smeared his <sighs> feces all over the cage door, all over the bottom of the cage, the front of the cage. He just had a smear party. He must have been so mad or something because he just he just threw poop all over everywhere. I had to clean it up. I had to Swiffer. I had to mop, scrub down the floors because it sank so bad. I had to scrub down his cage. I had to go outside and take the, the liner pad from the bottom of the cage, the black part. I had to take it outside and hose it down, wipe it down. Then I had to take out my Clorox wipes to sanitize it around. It was just, it's been, it's been a horrible, horrible morning right now. I don't know. I just, I don't know anymore, y'all. It's that type of morning. And then it's hard to film because this little munchkin, he likes to yap and yap and yap. <laughs> you have something to say? I know you're tired. And then my son has been subjected to this. He hasn't had to have any of his normal naps throughout the day like he usually has. He's been subjected to stay up. He's been tired out of his mind being cranky because, you know, he just wants to sleep so bad. But it's like the dog knows. It's okay, baby. I know you're choking off of that fart, huh? That fart was a tits, huh, baby? I know. That was some stank. <laughs> She has a problem. She will not eat out of this little container of food. I have to literally hand feed her. She's bougie. Look what he just, look, look what he did. Look what she did. Your lunch is over. Okay, real quick. So, um, we finished with the dog, put him away. We put her away. I always call her, call her him, and I feel so bad, but we put her away. Moana. <laughs> She's sleeping now. I guess the trick is to hand feed her. She's bougie, but it works, and as long as she's eating, I'm okay with it. Whatever way I have to do it to get her to eat, then that's the way I have to do it. Now that she's put away and calm, and I can actually talk to you guys, because I can't record when she's screaming and crying in the background. I can only handle one baby doing that. A couple days ago, I had went to the store, right? The beauty supply store, the hair store, you know, the sister store. <laughs> I had got another one of these. Remember I, I usually spray my hair with this? Jamaican black cast oil water. But I had ran out, so I got some more. Then while I was there, I also got two um, Eco Styler gels, cause obviously, you see this? This be saving my life. So I got some of that. My hair looks crazy this morning. <laughs> I also got some lashes. Hopefully they look good. And then I'm probably gonna have to grab him. He's getting upset. I know he's tired. 
um, I got some black lash glue. I want to try this out because this isn't the glue that I usually get. The glue that I get is actually for your hair or for like wigs and stuff or weaves. <laughs> the black glue. But I want to try this one out. Glue for the lashes so we'll see if it works. <sighs> and this guy. This little belly thing, look at this. I'm thinking I'm gonna try to like put it around my waist. If it fits around my waist, this girl. <laughs> He's looking at his mama like, what are you talking about? Ah. I hate when he gives me sloppy kisses. That's pretty much it that I got from the beauty supply store. It was a quick little haul or whatever. I really went in there just for the, I was looking for like the lash glue. And then I saw the spray and that reminded me that I needed some. And then I got a few other things, but this was just extra. <laughs> I want to try it out. I have a lot of beads, but none that fit around my waist. So we'll see if this one does. If it does, that'd be cute. That'll maybe motivate me even more to lose the rest of this stomach weight, you know. So then maybe, just maybe, <laughs> I'm gonna go put him to sleep because he's cranky and I know he's tired. That's all it is. He's just sleepy. <laughs> oh man. All right, guys. So I had brought up some of the stuff that I showed you guys when I was downstairs that I had bought. So I'm just trying to put it away. But I also want to like brush my hair up a little bit, feel a little bit better, you know, brush my teeth and stuff because I had changed this morning. I had a cute dress on, but remember how I was telling you guys the dog had a big like poop explosion? Got poop on my dress too. So I had to change and throw something on real quick or she just, you know. <laughs> Either way, I'm good though. Uh, I'm gonna put this stuff away. But I also want to show you guys an update on my flowers. I don't know, like this time around my flowers for, from um, Trader Joe's aren't doing so well. I don't know if I'm not good with the tulips this time or the other flowers, but look at this one. They're like, look so sad. <laughs> I don't know what I did. The only thing is I can think of, maybe it's getting too much light. I don't know. But it's not doing too hot, so there's that one. <laughs> They're all kind of like just limping down and dying on me. I'm really excited about these lashes. I'm gonna try it, and when I try it, I'm gonna show y'all. I'm gonna try to put them on. I haven't put on lashes in a minute, cause I could never find anyone. You guys know, like when I was telling you guys I was trying to get my lashes done like professionally and put on individually. I always got canceled on, or the last, the last lash lady I had, she was pregnant, so I don't know. So I'm just gonna try these little strip lashes and see what happens. Yeah, no luck so far. Try to probably miss my hair real quick. Missed this spray. I really want to try this and put it around my belly, but girlish. I don't know. It looks like it's stretchy though. It might stretch. And then after this, I'm probably going to start folding or finish up folding Nehemiah's laundry that I had started on a couple days ago. But I have quickly learned that it takes a while to get most things done around my house. It's not like this one to finish damn quick thing it, it's it's a process even just to do my laundry or his laundry it takes a couple days to wash it dry it fold it put it away and throughout all that time that i'm trying to do that i'm piling up more laundry so it's like i can never really get ahead <laughs> so there's that Man, this um castor oil water smells so good. I forgot how it smells. It smells so good. I'm literally just trying to brush it up so I don't look too crazy on camera. <laughs> and I think Nehemiah is getting restless anyway. He might have to sit in the room with me while I fold some laundry. Let me go check on him. I heard him. He's okay. He's just rolling around. I had built this little barrier on the couch to keep him contained because he rolls so much. I'm going to show y'all. <laughs> Just so that I could do my hair and do stuff. I had to build a fort <laughs> around him so that he doesn't go anywhere. But slowly he's getting stronger. He's been like destroying my forts that I create for him like on my bed or on the couch, anywhere. So that's worrisome too. He's just too smart for his own good. Okay, I feel like I look a little bit better. Don't look too crazy. I'm gonna 
might clean my face off a little bit. Oh, real quick, I just saw these right now, but look it. You see these socks? I still have not shown you guys the, pl the newest plants that Chris got me. I don't think I have. If I haven't, I need to show you guys today. But he also got me some socks because he went to LA with his friend and he stopped at a plant shop for me and got some new plants for me. And then he got me these plant socks. Aren't these cute? I think they're hecka cute. <laughs> All right, let's go fold some. Oh wait, before we fold on, let me clean my face. Duh, I'm just gonna like use like a cloth or something. I usually use these things, the makeup remover wipes, but I've been loving these that I showed you guys before on my channel. These um, cleansing pads by Trader Joe's. They have tea tree oil in them. I just feel like they really like clean it my face real good. Especially on like my sweatier days, I feel like it really does the job good. Like, and I can see it, it's like, and it gets it all off. Clouds are so high above the ground, I'm rising, I'm rising, I'm so... Hope y'all don't mind me being this close to the camera. I need to put some chapstick on because I'm tired of coming on camera with some chapped lips. That is not cute. No. So I gotta fix that. It's like evening time though, it's like three o'clock right now. So it's kind of later in the day. I'm surprised I'm filming right now, but I'm trying to be more productive. But yeah, I'm gonna fold some laundry. And then I'm, I'm probably going to fold his laundry. I, my laundry is still in the dryer. I need to fold mine. But I'm probably going to fold his laundry, put it away, and then probably do the dishes. I'll probably worry about my laundry maybe tonight or tomorrow. I don't know. I mostly want to make sure like his laundry is always done. And that his stuff's always organized because it makes it easier for me to find stuff for him. I, can, I still can't believe he's wearing six to nines right now. It still blows my mind. He's kind of quiet. Let me check on him. This dude is fully... So I laid him on his back like this, right? Tell me why he's on his chest this way. Like with his head up looking at the TV. So I had him back this way looking at the TV. He's forward. He did a whole 360 and turned over. That's insane. I'm gonna show y'all because that's crazy. I just can't imagine. This is why I built the fort because I can't deal. I had to like put pillows all the way around him because he rolls so much. But he was laying... His head was right here. And his legs are over there. How is his head over here now? And he's facing the TV. Ain't that crazy? Look at this dude. I can't contain him, y'all. He's just going crazy. Yeah, I'm talking about you. <laughs> Ain't that crazy, though? I feel like that's just a little too fast. In my opinion. I, I just... That's a little much. I feel a little bit better when I clean my face, brush my hair up a little bit. It makes me feel a lot better. He got upset, y'all. and everything but we don't share toothbrushes i'm not sharing my toothbrush with you i needed some i need to put some chapstick on y'all Hey babe, yeah. were you in the bathroom that whole time? Yeah. <gasps> okay, yeah. that's scary because when I walked downstairs, you were in the bed, so I didn't hear you even go across the hall. And I was like, why is the bathroom light on? I got a little spooked out, so I just turned it off. I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Jeez, I was wondering. I was like, no way. I just turned the light off on you. I didn't hear Chris go into the bathroom, and I had turned the light off on him. Because in the hallway, in the hall bathroom, I just saw the light on but I never heard anyone go into the bathroom. And he was in there and I just turned it off on him. <laughs> all right, I think that's gonna be it. That's all he let me do, but that's okay. I got some chapstick on. I brushed my teeth. My hair's combed a little bit. I feel a little bit better. You know, a little bit better. You ready to do some laundry with mommy? Let's finish your laundry. Hey, no touch, don't touch that. Okay, y'all. This is how I usually do laundry on the floor. <laughs> I 
I just realized, like, I might as well do his nails because they grow so fast, y'all. Like, I literally just did it. Y'all saw me in the video, like, maybe, like, a week ago. And it just, it grew so fast. And I have to cut them because he scratches me and Chris really bad in the face. You guys, I did not know that he had a blowout and when he was laying down after I cut his nails, I checked and I saw that his diaper was like overflowed and it, it was poop on the sides. Luckily he didn't get that um, little baby bed messed up but I traced back my steps and I went back downstairs to check on his jumper and the other little play thing he was laying on, the, the jumper seat. It got stained up so now i gotta figure out how to take off the seat part of it and maybe possibly wash it because it's all stained up i don't know how i didn't notice that look at that you guys see that is super annoying i just i can't even look at his the bottom of his onesie oh my goodness Okay, I just finished changing his diaper, but now he's hungry. You see what I mean? This is why some things just never get done. I was so close to folding some clothes or finishing up. Cause look at I had started. See, I had, that was that pile there. And then this is what I have left. And I was slowly putting stuff in the drawers that I folded away. I'm like halfway there. I like, I did half of the laundry a couple days ago. I was so close to finishing it, but now he's hungry. Hopefully, possibly I can maybe come back to this after, but I'm really about to go downstairs and first try to figure out how to take that thing, how to take that seat off the jumper, because I'm just so disappointed in myself that I didn't realize he, his, it was time to change his diaper basically, but yeah, that happened. So let me go figure this out. Feel better? You feel better, Sean? This is where he had the blow out up, right there. So I'm gonna try to take this off. Hopefully I can wash this. I'm gonna try to. And probably just sanitize the whole thing then. All right, so I got it off. The stain, right there. See it? Gross. So I got it off. It, I, I tried to read like the instructions on here, but to be honest, I didn't see anything about washing it. So I'm just gonna throw it in there. Y'all remember this dress from Mother's Day? I had to wash it because remember, if y'all watched my video, he had a blowout on this. So it's clean now. I just gotta let it air dry out. I really want to go old school and build me like one of those line hangers outside. I think that'd be so cute. <laughs> and have like little like clothing pins and just let my stuff air dry outside. I think that'd be so cute. I really want to try that. But for now, washing machine it is. Our dryer it is. So I'm probably put like two in here and see what happens. I'm not gonna dry it though, I'm just gonna wash it because there's plastic there's there's plastic pieces on there. Alright, he's crying. I'm about to feed him real quick and then hopefully I can go back to folding his laundry. We shall see. I never know what the day is gonna bring me. Alright, so while that's washing, I'm just gonna make me some yogurt with like some granola. Nothing fancy. Is it me or does anyone else like to pick out their blueberries? Cause I like to get specific ones. Cause some of them, see what I mean? Cause some of the blueberries be like mushy. So I try to get the ones that are like firm. All, 
All right. So there's my yogurt. All right, so I'm about to make some dinner, but before I do so, I wanted to take out his toys because I had sanitized it so that he can play with them. Now that they're all clean, while Nehemiah is busy playing with his toys, I want to make some pasta today. So on the packaging, it says, I need to open this package and add pasta to two quarts of boiling water. So I need to boil two quarts of water. The problem is, I don't know what two quarts is, so I need to Google it. Okay, so I just figured out that two quarts, two quarts of water is eight cups. Wait, yeah. So two quarts of water is eight cups of water. So we're going to do eight cups of water. So I'm going to put this back in the fridge for now until the, the water starts boiling. I like to be precise, <laughs> so this is going to be eight. Alright, so now we wait. Oh, let me look at, so I can be ahead of the game, let me look at what else I need to do. Reduce the heat and boil gently for five minutes or longer. For a soft bite, stir frequently. Okay, that's pretty easy as long as I don't overcook or undercook the pasta. We'll see. I'm not really a good pasta maker. I always overcook it or undercook it. But we're going to try today. So what I'm thinking is, this one's chicken. So I don't know if I should do the pesto and basil. The spinach cheese and tortellini one that I have for next time. I feel like that would go better with the pesto one. I think. So I think I'm gonna do it. The, I think I'm gonna do the chicken and one with spicy red pepper pesto. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do dish one. I'm, I think I'm gonna add salt to the water because I heard if you add salt, it makes it boil faster. All right, so it started boiling, so now I'm about to add the pasta to it. I really hope I cook this right. <laughs> the packaging is ridiculous. They act like they got gold in here. Oh gosh, I'm scared, y'all. I don't want it to splash on me. So it's in there cooking. Wish me luck, y'all. Okay, so now I have to reduce the heat and boil gently for five minutes. What is boil gently? Like, for real, though, what is boil gently? It's either boiling or not boiling. What's a boil gently? I'm just gonna turn it down. I just put it on, like, medium, like, in between. Hopefully that helps. So I'm gonna do it for about five to seven minutes, because they say if you do it a little bit longer than five minutes, that um, it should be, like, a little bit of a softer bite. I need to grab my timer. Set timer for seven minutes. All right. <laughs> and then I have this little cool thing. I've always wanted to use this thing, but I've never had a reason to. But now I do, because you girl, you know, she up great in her chef skills up in here. We making pasta, you know. We ain't basic around here. We got a little pasta spoon. You know, to like stir it up, whip it up, pick it up, you know. <laughs> but I'm going to try to keep stirring it occasionally. Like maybe I'll stir it right now. Alright you guys, so it's been seven minutes. All right, I think it's done, I think. I mean, I did it longer than the five minutes that they told me to do it for, so I'm guessing that it's done. I mean, it should have been already probably cooked, at least the chicken, because it was 
refrigerated. But it looks like it's pretty much done. I'm just gonna go for it and see what happens. I don't know what this says. This one says, am I supposed to warm this up or anything? It said must be kept refrigerated, so yeah. Okay, I don't know. It's gonna, I guess it goes on there cold. And then I also got my cheese. spicy or not oh yeah it is spicy duh i forgot i was like why does it smell so spicy i'm pretty sure it's cold and this pasta is hot but i'm hopefully it even out if not i'll just warm the pasta back up in the microwave or something i'm pretty sure you just add it so i'm just gonna add it Finished putting on the spicy sauce. So I'm about to add some Parmesan cheese to it. I feel like that's just gonna make it chef's kiss. It's gonna hit real, real nice. It's gonna be real, real good. And I'm like gonna lightly stir it in and hopefully it melts a little bit because it's a little cold and stiff. So hopefully it like melts becomes more cheesy but just a little bit and i think that's pretty much it all right you guys that's pretty much my dinner you know it's gonna hit real real nice now i'm about to plate it up and make it look fancy you know because i'm fancy like that you know, I gotta romanticize, you know, I can't just eat it out of a bowl. I gotta eat it out of a nice bowl. So what I'm thinking is I'm gonna get this clear one right here. Isn't it cute? I think it's cute. Oh, no.